everyone! Look who this is! This is Nipper, my new kitten. Isn't he cute? Put him back down. So today's video is just going to be a review of the Wild Child box that I was given from Wash. And I'm um, we'll just on the back it's got a little description and picture of everything. And I'm basically just going to run through everything and um, just give you my opinions on things and uh, let you know what I think about them. So the first one is the Up You Get Emoti Bomb. And it speeds speed up in the morning with a citrusy smack in the shower. And I've used half of it and it looks like this. On the picture it looks like this. This one here. So it's a little person. And it smells like um, lemons, basically. Now, what the idea that you're supposed to do is you're supposed to put this in your bath, uh, in your shower. Um, if you're not somebody that takes a lot of baths and stuff, um, but you like the Lush products, that type of thing, what they've brought out is the um, emoti bombs where you can put that at the bottom of the shower and it'll dissolve up and it'll make the um, room smell really nice. Now it's not something that I personally, I mean I've used half of it and I, I'm impressed with the scent that it gives off but it's not something that I personally think is worth the investment in buying that because I much prefer having baths or I like the bath bombs and, and that type of things. Now the next one is the bubblegum lip scrub, this one. I'll just cover them. So this one here. And it says, scrub on this candy flavoured lip scrub and then lick off. Repeat step one and again. Um, and it looks like this when you get it. And inside, it looks like this. And this smells absolutely amazing I really like this product all you do is you take a tiny bit preferably when you've got a wet wet face and then you just rub it on your lips and what that does is it exfoliates your lips now it does dissolve into the lips so you don't necessarily need to even have a wet lip because it just dissolves into your lips and it tastes really nice and it's really bubbly gummy and it really does exfoliate your um, skin and the skin around your lips and your, and your actual lips and I really enjoy it because I find that most exfoliators are quite um, harsh on your lips and um, the two, um, what's the word, they're like, the two rough on your skin so I like the um, lip scrub from Lush. So that's the bubblegum lip scrub. The next thing is the Rockstar Soap. It says pink, sweet and full of confidence. Soap with attitude. And it's this one here. See that? And it looks like this. I've used the end, obviously. And this is just a really nice soap, it, the fragrance stays on your skin for a very long time and you can really smell it for a sorry I keep looking over there because the kittens are both upstairs and they're fighting so I keep looking at them to make sure they're not attacking anything that they shouldn't be. So I mean it smells really nice, it, um, it stays on your skin for a long time and it doesn't leave your skin oily or it's just a really nice soap. All you need to do is break off a tiny bit uh, and then just work that tiny bit into your hand and then onto your skin. The next thing is the Happy Hippie Shower Gel. This one. And it says, mellow yellow hair and body gel with freshly squeezed grapefruits. Just the thing for cent centralising your aura. And it looks like this, the packaging. On the front it says the same. And I would say it smells more lemony than grapefruit 
but I've used this on my body and on my hair and I really like it on both. The only thing I will say about your hair is it really, if you've got like non-greasy hair it can dry it out so you do need to make sure that you condition after because I don't have greasy hair um, after I've used it I'm finding that my hair is quite dry so I just need to use like a, a, fa um, a hair mask or something afterwards and the last thing is um, the sweetie pie shower jelly sparkling fruity shower jelly that softly caresses your hair and skin it looks like that And the packaging looks like this. And inside, you know, it does smell really nice and it looks like that. So you can see it's a, a jelly like substance. Absolutely hate this product. It doesn't, first of all, it's incredibly hard to get the product out. Um, it just wants to stay as a whole so when you're trying to get a tiny bit off for your hair or your body it's I don't know what's going on with the lightning Um when you're trying to get it for your hair or your body it, it takes ages just to, like rip a tiny piece off and then when you're rubbing it on your skin it, it doesn't dissolve at all so my advice would be just stay away from that product don't buy it don't get it don't try it it's not worth the money it's it's ridiculous I mean the other four products the three of them I'm really happy with. One of them, the the lip scrub, the soap and the shower gel, I really like. The Emoti Balm I think is okay, but it's not worth the money. And the Sweetie Pie is just rubbish. Just don't get it. Just don't waste your money on getting it. I mean, I was given the Lush box, so I didn't actually pay for it. So I haven't spent any of my money on actually purchasing these items. So obviously for something that was free, it's nice, but it's not something that I would recommend for um, for you guys to go out there and purchase it. So yeah, that's my review on the Wild Child box from Lush. Um, and that's everything. So I just want to thank you for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and comment below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.